Is Mr Rubini uh, overdoing it on the risks that face uh, this economy and these equity markets? I don't, I don't think so. He has always been quite bearish on, uh, on uh, markets and uh, overall on the macroeconomic backdrop, but I think he has a point now. Uh, inflationary pressures are high. Uh, we don't even think that the bond markets are really uh, pricing them all in. Look at the five-year, five-year forwards. Uh, there is there is still room to have negative surprises, and obviously central banks are walking a fine line here, and uh, they might just stay behind the curve, which obviously doesn't help inflation. So there's a serious risk on the yeah. global economy, and not only again, not only in Europe and not only in the UK, but uh, a much further risk. Um, Fabiana, you're, you're very diplomatic. Also, the fact that Mr. Doom now could be close to calling it right should really make a lot of investors worry. Do you worry about stagflation? Is that your base case scenario? And if yes, does it mean a huge correction for all equities? It's not a base case scenario, but it's clearly a, there is clearly a higher risk of it happening. So at the moment, when you look at equities, we um, we just see markets being far too complacent. We see expensive valuations, particularly in some pockets of the markets. The truth is, if we are in a real recession, what generally happens is that equities will underperform other asset classes. Within equities, the markets that are perceived to be safer, such as the US, will do better. Uh, also helped by a stronger dollar, most likely as the capital flows flow into into dollar-related assets. But at the same time, right now, the U.S. market is, an, is at an all-time high in terms of valuations, and, and that makes the choice more difficult for equity investors.